from the um, founding of the nation um, to the Transcontinental Railroad, the New Deal, and to the war after World War II, national infrastructure banks have played a central role in America's uh, funding system. Uh, what we need to do and what this bank will do, it'll remove from um, this funding system from the politics and separate it from the federal budget and be grounded in restoring and the country to greatness again. Uh, first off, that, that, to answer your question, then I'll get back to one other comment. Uh, in Delaware, I've served in the Senate for 13 years. This will be my 13th year. And I prior to that, I served 25 years in the state House of Representatives. So I've got a little bit of seniority uh, in the chambers, obviously. But how, how the uh, National Infrastructure Bank will assist uh, this problem is that it will provide low interest loans for funding for infrastructure, for affordable housing, as well as numerous other infrastructure that's needed in this country and has been needed for years. And in addition to that, the 25 million living wage jobs, as the state had previously, will give in people more earning power. Should they want to rent? Should they want to purchase a home? Funds that they do not presently have, many of them today. We have a number of people in our state living in manufactured homes, which is supposed to be affordable housing. But of course, it's on lease land, and that creates a problem. Uh, sometimes it's not as affordable as people think. But we spent millions of dollars every year in our bond bill to increase housing for Delawareans. And then those millions of dollars are matched by the federal government. But it's still far too short what's needed. I didn't want to mention also that in, in running this bill in the Senate as a prime sponsor a Senate resolution, I want to mention that uh, Delaware, as many of you know, was called the first state. When this bill passed the Senate, I reminded my colleagues that in addition to Delaware being the first state, we're the first state again today. And what I meant by that was we passed this bill at 3.59 in the afternoon on January the 27th this year. That was a day that the Coalition for National Infrastructure Bank set a national day to jumpstart this national infrastructure bank issue. We were the first state that day, the 27th, to pass this resolution. 